to Dose by Marquita. This is $1,300 in one week with no promotions. I say no promotions because it's no promotions. <laughs> but there is a car top bonus that is involved. But the car top bonus is only $100. So if you take away the car top bonus, then that's $1,200 in one week. If you did this for about two weeks straight, you could make about $2,400. Monday. So this was Monday, June the 20th. Now, this is the week I work seven days straight. Now, I don't know about you and how you do it, but sometimes when I got bills to pay and, you know, I got a, a financial goal I'm trying to hit, sometimes I go hard and go seven days. So this week, particularly, I went seven days. So this started June 20th. Now, I'll put... um. A picture right here so you guys can follow along with me but um I only worked seven hours and 48 minutes that was it I did not do an 11 hour day this day I did 21 trips my net fare was $56 tips $53.83 total earnings $109.85 and I wasn't discouraged I kept going so moving on to Tuesday now you see Tuesday says $241.57 now the reason why this is so much is because I had the car top display. Now, I worked 11 hours and 10 minutes, which was still a good amount of time to work. I did 29 trips. Because you know, like when you're doing Uber, Uber Eats, your fare is not the same every day. It's like hustling. Sometimes you get, you know, a good profit, and then sometimes you don't. <laughs> That's how it is when you're working for yourself. I mean... It's not a set goal. It's not like a set job. But the thing is, you can make more than a regular job by doing this. So, anyway, net fare was $62.73. Tips, $103.84. And the car top display, $75, which brought me to $241.57. But if you took away the car top display, I would have about over $165 for that day, which is still good, in my opinion, anyway. Um, next on Wednesday, um, I only worked four, um, seven hours and 49 minutes. I did 22 trips. Um, the net fare was $48 and 42 cents tips, $87 and 49 cents. You see the tips is like double what I made. So total earnings, $135 and 91 cents. So moving on to Thursday. Thursday, I made $194.25. I only worked nine hours and 33 minutes. If you notice, I haven't been working 12 hours straight this week. So I wasn't killing myself to get this $1,300, but I still was able to do good this week, even though I wasn't working 11 hour shifts. So nine hours and 33 minutes, um, 26 trips I did. Um, Net fare $65.89. Tips $103.36. Um, my car top display $25 and total earnings $194.25. Now you see the car top display this time said $25. Last time it was $75. So, like I said, you can only make a hundred dollars with the car top display in a week. So it's like you drive for 20 hours, you get $75. And then if you drive an additional 15 or 10 hours, something like that, you get an extra $25. Okay, so next we're going over to Friday. Friday, hold up, that said $25 car top display on Thursday. And on Friday, it say the same thing. Hold on, let me find out. Oh, I am about to say, okay, I had to look at Saturday. All right, let's get back on topic. <laughs> Because if you look at Friday, like you see what I'm saying, it say car top display twenty five dollars, and I'm like, how you get two car top displays? You know what they need to they need to uh, explain this to me at Uber Eats. But on um, June twenty fourth, I made eight. Uh, while I was working eight hours and twenty two minutes, I only did twenty trips. My net fare was ninety one dollars and twenty one cents. Um, tips were one hundred two dollars and eighty two cents. Car top display says $25 and then $219.03. So I don't know. I'm like, I don't know if I get $25 twice because that's what it said. I mean, look at here. Thursday. Thursday say car top display $25. Friday car top display $25. And they added it in on both days. Moving on. Saturday. 
Saturday, I worked 12 hours and 24 minutes. I did 31 trips. So $86.33 net fare. Tips, I know you see it, right? <laughs> I'm telling you, tips can be like this with Uber Eats, I'm, especially here. Like, I'm not sure where you're from, but these people are generous with their tips. I love how generous people are here in Dallas. Net fare, $86.33 tips, $145.86. And that day, I made $232.19. Let's go over to Sunday. Sunday says a promotion, as you can see, but it was $1.91. And I wasn't working for that promotion. I don't even know what that is. I'm being honest. Like, I have no idea. But the net fare... $71.41. Only worked nine hours and 46 minutes. So I was doing, this week wasn't like a hard, hard week to work at that. But I still made over $1,300. As you see, the net fare, $71.41. Promotions, $1.91. Tips, $108.21. And then total earnings, $181.53. So that gave me a pretty good week totaling $1,314.33. Car top display. Well, on oh, here, so it is one. So it's 125 a week. I thought it was 100 a week. Okay, so car top display 125 and in total earnings $1,326.14. Now that's pretty good. That's really, really good. Like some people can pay their rent with that, you know, in a week. And then the other three weeks could be for getting out of debt or whatever else you want to do. But um, that's how I made $1,300 within that week. Um, I'll do um, certain like uh, tips and, and um, little things that get you, um, I would say, extra dollars in your Uber Eats, I believe, anyway. But I want to do a separate video on that because I feel like I got a lot of gems a lot of jewels that i can share with you guys but um that was a really good week as well so i know some people may have looked at my last video and said how i made fifteen hundred dollars in a week actually it was um that week was actually over sixteen hundred but i put fifteen hundred dollars <throat> and i wanted to do one without the promotions because with promotions you know you don't always get promotions with uber eats and i've learned that the hard way like you do not always get promotions here and i thought i mean with uber eats side now with regular uber that might be something different uber i believe they um do more promotions but uber eats mm, not so much they don't really really do too many promotions but that the first few weeks when i was doing uber eats oh my god and me and my husband actually they was throwing those um they was throwing those promotions to us left and right left and right and then we finally was like forget it we just going to do the promotions and we did the promotions and we was good at it then all of a sudden they just stopped sending it to us so i don't know if you want to um depend on this full time it's up to you like i said me personally i have a financial goal um i'm a licensed cosmetologist so i'm only doing this to really like you know get some income together but um I just want to end out in a word of prayer and I want to pray for everyone before I sign off. Father God, we love you. We thank you for this beautiful day of life. Thank you for your grace and your mercy and for blessing us to see another one of your beautiful days, Father God. I just ask that you will be with us in our journey to um, getting more income, to do the things that you would have us to do, Father God. Help us to seek you in prayer, reading our Bibles, and to, to constantly put you first in our lives, Father God. Help us to seek Holy Spirit for answers on what it is that we should be doing to get financial gain in our lives, Father God. Father God, we're only doing what we can, and a lot of us are tired of working a nine to five and really just want to get into business for working for ourselves. I ask that you would give us the right strategies, the right knowledge, the right understanding. I ask that you equip me as well, Father God, with the tools to gain more um, knowledge and understanding and how to obtain more income so that I can share it with the world as well. But uh, Father God, I ask that if there is anyone under the sound of my voice that does have more uh, ways to, to gain income that they will share in the comment um, box as well so that other people can see it. 
I just uh, pray that the kingdom, the kingdom of God just expands and that we become more financially free and able to actually enjoy life and don't have to be so um, <clears throat> ball and chain to a nine to five because a lot of times nine to fives are not fulfilling. They don't bring financial freedom. A lot of times we still remain in debt and we just ask that you will help us to get on the path to obtaining our seven yay eight ventures so our seven or eight different streams of income like the word says father god help us to be able to attain these different streams of income um, but we need we need holy spirit to help us we need your guidance in this and also i pray safe traveling mercies for anyone that is doing uber eats or uber um i ask that they will be vigilant and be smart and listen to you their gut feelings, if something doesn't feel right, that they won't pick up a passenger or a meal or whatever. Um, help them to really uh, be able to use discernment while they're out here in the field, Father God. But Father, we love you and we just thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your grace. Thank you for your mercy. Thank you for these grant opportunities and giving people ideas like this to help us, people like us, to just make a few dollars just to pay rent or whatever it is we have to pay for. But we love you. We thank you. I pray blessings and prosperity for Uber and any other type of monetary game app that is out there um, to help people like us. But we love you. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 All right, y'all. Thank you all for watching. I have more and more videos coming up. Let me know if you have any requests. If there's anything that you want to see, then I'll go ahead and put it on here. But until next time, see ya. Ha, ha, ha.